Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Slime Rancher. So a few things have changed. As you can see, I have upgraded everything. I am currently at, well, jetpack's a jetpack. I haven't got the air, well, I've got the, sorry, no, I have the air drive. Okay. And I have dash boots. I've gone up to Mark three actually with some of these, the tank booster, for example, because I literally could not keep up with um well the amount of plorts i've been getting to be quite honest i mean i i need to come back here and show you a little something because i now have uh all five filled with uh honey boomers and as you can see they're all eating mink mint mangoes which doubles their output and they're about to uh Provide me with many, many plorts, which is wonderful. Just wonderful. It's, I mean, seriously, I, I, I love these guys. I love these little explodey guys because they have just given me so much wealth. I mean, look, 56,000, uh, whatever the hell that, uh, thing is, the, uh, Whatever the uh, currency is in this game. I, I don't actually know the name for it. Not gonna lie. Oh, um, by the way, uh, to my friend uh, Avondia, Anovdia, uh, Eva. Uh, yeah, I know, I, I done derped. I done derped a lot. Come on, pick them up. Fucking hell. I really don't want to run in there with them. Ah, there we go. Uh, yeah, I genuinely did not notice the that when you look at one of these, you can see what they eat and what the name is. Honey Boom Largos. I didn't know that at all. It, nev I, it never occurred to me. Also, sub-program, I have looked into why I might not be getting Star Mail. And yeah, it looks like the star mail is shared by is shared in within the app as in you only get star mail for one character which is kind of weird i'm guessing it's a bug because i would have expected that to actually be not like that but it is what it is what can you do i've got space for 10 more there yeah i'm gonna need to I am going to actually need to upgrade this even more if I can. Uh, purchase. <laughs> that's maxed. Oh boy, that that that's a little bit scary. Just make sure that I don't have any more to pick up from them. Any more to pick up over, over here? Nope. But it goes to show just how efficient this setup is. I literally just have nothing but mint mangoes because I'm using boomers. Because I'm using honey booms, I am not actually wasting anything. It's worth it. It's well worth it, and it works quite well. I just want to check on my puddle slimes. I went back to that area, and I picked up a lot more puddle slimes. So I have... Um, uh, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry, dude. I picked up more just because, well, they're passive generation of wealth. I mean, that is a good thing. Passive generation, definitely one of my favorite aspects of this game. And one time, actually, you know something? I have got a couple of extra places here, so I'm just going to load them up with um, one with pogo fruit and one with carrots just because right now they are sitting here doing me absolutely no good whatsoever because there's nothing oh hang on did I really only have I had one spare oh that kind of blows okay well whatever Now that's a battery farm. Okay, let's go sell these and then we're gonna buy ourselves a lab because that's what I've been working towards, a lab. 
God. So the one problem with this set with this setup is I really kind of wish that there was a way to automate picking up uh, the mint mangoes and putting them into the silo. Also, I wish there was a way to automate them going from the silo to the uh, to the corrals because as things stand. There is no easy way to do that other than manually, and it takes a lot of time. On the plus side, I now have so many mint mangoes, I can safely ignore their uh, harvesting for a little while at least. You know, not eternally, but for a little while. Is that it? That looks like it. Okay. sell those plorts. Um, I'll actually maybe I should hang on to them until I open this because I have no idea what this is going to entail. Purchase. You've unlocked the lab, a special ranch expansion that will allow you to create gadgets using slime science. Head over to the barn and get started. Okay. I have... <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, I can't open that. I think this is just going to go inside the grotto. It does... This was the place that was locked off. Awesome. Whee. Oh. Oh man, this is cool. This is seriously, seriously cool. Time to get crafty. This barn has all the equipment you need to begin crafting gadgets using slime science. Gadgets include useful utilities to avoid aid in exploring, defensive turrets, decorations, and more. And that lets me... An incinerator? Don't need it? Burn it. I... I did not mean to do that. I I actually am not entirely sure what I just... What the hell is that? The refinery. In order to fabricate gadgets, you'll need resources in the refinery. Try shooting a plort into the refinery. But remember, any resources deposited in the refinery cannot be removed. Okay. Okay, so that's... That's the refinery. Okay. Interesting. And then this... This is the builder shop. Apiaries, wild bees. Pink teleporter. Set up a two teleporters that can be used to create your own quick travel link. I like that. Pink wart depot. Set a set of gadgets to allow you to tra remotely transfer resources. Oh, oh my god. It's automation, people. It's automation. We finally have automation. And this is the fabric. Novice drill allows you to drill for buried mineral minerals last one cycle. What the hell the hell one cycle is? Utilities, swarp tech, decorations of curios. Okay, let's let's two, three, four, five, six. Um Okay. In order to fabricate gadgets, you'll need resources in the refinery. Try shooting a plort into the refinery, but remember the builder's shop allows you to purchase blueprints. A blueprint is required to build any gadget. Be sure to check the builder shop often for new blueprints. Now there was one that I saw that I really wanted, which is this. Okay, which goes over there, okay, I think. Fabricator, once you have the blueprint, the fabricator allows you to craft gadgets. Okay, so utilities, warp tech. That requires pink plorts, primordial oil, slime fossils, and lava dust. Learn more. Warp Tech is a class of slime science gadgets that allow you to harness the power of instantaneous traffic. Uh, I wonder is there one for automated harvesting? There must be. I mean, surely there is. Hydro turret, automatic tires, slime hoop. Begins around a slime ball as soon as a single slime passes through the hoop. What's your sky high score? Number one slime stage allows you to let other slimes know who is unequivocally number one slime. Pink slime lamp and decorative lamp. Uh, novice drill, pink slime depot. A set of two gadgets. I already have that. Novice pump allows you to siphon underground resources. Purchase. Purchase. This is why I saved up so much money because I didn't know what was going to be here. And Purchase. Gadget mode. In order to place gadgets, you need to enable gadget mode. T toggle gadget mode for T. Okay, purchase. That's nice. Purchase. Purchase. 
Okay, um, novice drill allows you to drill for minerals, pumps, and an apiary. Oh, I'm going to need, yeah, that's going to be, what the hell is a rad plort? Med station drains your energy to restore health. Warp tech, deep brine, hexacomb, strange diamonds. Uh, that's okay, and a slime fossil. Okay, so what we actually, I think we need is this, um, or this. Okay, so I guess what we really need to do is pick up as many resources as we can out in the wild, because I, <laughs> that was very silly. Tea. Oh, that's interesting. Build sites, in gadget mode, you cannot vac or shoot, which you can see all the build sites in the world. You can place your gadget. Have a look around. Oh, that's cool. That is really cool. I like that. I approve of this. I really do. Okay, I would, but I have no resources to do so. This is going to be a problem, people. Um... Not a huge problem, mind you, because what I can do is, um, well, I'm not entirely sure what I can do, to be quite honest. I wish I could say I had a really good idea, but I don't. I don't. However, I have a lot of pink mangoes, so maybe I should go and try and pop that honey largo. Honey largo? The giant honey. Okay, so what? If I go to T, extractors, utilities, warp text, decorations, curios. I can't do that because I don't have any of those things, but that's okay. Because we are going to. Uh, we don't need money right now. What we need are plorts. And. Uh, Might as well top these up while I'm here. And then we're going to go out and we're going to find ourselves some... Uh, we're going to find ourselves a giant honey slime. And things are going to be glorious. We are going to make money. We are going to develop entirely new types of... Um, entirely new types. I will occasionally do this because... Uh, Boom. Boom. Sometimes these will actually rot out of the world. Which kind of sucks, but... You know, it is the way it is, and there's not much I can do about it. Nope. Get in there. I have noticed that they do occasionally despawn, and that's a pain in the ass. Now... But also usually I'm able to, between one load of mangoes from my farm and what's down here, I can usually top out my, my mangoes, usually. Ow. Ooh. So many more plorts. Uh. Helpful if you... Oh, I can't do that. Fuck. Uh, <laughs> that would be a problem. Okay, so I... I need to grab some more mangoes. That's fine. I also need to... Do, do, do. I'm going to put... I should have grabbed another plort. Ah, why didn't I do that? Um, I'm going to dump another... I'm going to dump a full load of boom plorts in there. That'll be 50 and, well, 14, 9 and 50. Not a lot I can do about that. But that's okay. I'm doing fine for money right now. I've also discovered if you immediately drop from one to these to the other, it just goes a lot faster. An awful lot faster. Uh, ooh, what can I use these for? I can make corrals. Okay, that's good. So what we're going to do is we're going to figure out what resources we need 
from slimes. And we'll go from there, I guess. So yeah, we figure out what, and we'll just make just enough of each slime to allow for, well, that. Do, do, do. That's fine. I think this one is golden as well. I am going to need some money. Not a huge amount, but I'm going to need it. Because, well, I'm going to have to make a crap ton more corrals, apparently. I need rad. Oh, how am I going to get rad? I'm guessing the, that honey slime will... Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Will drop a pretty decent supply of... Uh, or a, a key to an area that is... That will give me access to honey slimes. At least I'm hoping that's what it'll do. Because if it doesn't, I don't know what the hell I'm supposed to do. And that's being honest. Uh, do, do, do. Yeah, this is... I may end up having to get rid of certain things. And that's going to suck. Um, I mean, these have been great for making me money, but... Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. <laughs> I love the way that when they do explode, they tend to explode in sequence. It, it is something I'm really fond of, I have to say. Okay. We are going to go and speak. And when I say speak, I mean feed. That, uh... Giant honey and see what that gets us. Uh, I'm hoping 50 mint mangoes is enough because if it isn't, I don't know what in the hell I'm supposed to do. That's uh, a decent amount of money. Um, ooh, okay. Uh, might as well pink up pink plorts while I'm out here. I'd read for now at least because. I'm going to need tabbies as well, aren't I? Oh, this is going to be a this is going to be problematic. Diet everything. Okay, so it doesn't have a favorite, which is good. Let's see if we can get a couple of tabbies. They're usually down here somewhere. Ooh. Eh. Tabbies? Here, tabby, 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 tabby. Aha. We have. Uh, I'd like to get six of these because I'm going to need a lot of tabby uh, a lot of tabby plorts unfortunately but that's that's okay we'll work with that there's another one do not eat a pink slime you a pink slime plort you little bastard um Do I need that many pink plorts? I don't. I just need six. Although, actually, now that I think about it, they're pretty innocuous to use, so... Oh, I'm going to need to get phosphor slimes, aren't I? Oh, boy. This just opens up a whole new layer of complexity to the shit I'm going to have to do. Uh... I can always get pink plorts. I do not need to be carrying them. Ooh. We got a gold plort. That alone makes this little trip worth it. Get. Oh, for fuck's sake. 
Come on, I need... Okay, back to base, I guess, because, uh, yeah, I'm not going to go adventuring when I have these, and we're going to create... Actually, I might as well convert all of those into corrals, I guess. Hmm. I'm gonna have to get rid of some of my booms, my honey booms. I don't have a choice in that because just there's a limit to what I can do. So that is one of the limits. Uh, so maybe if I put, oh, fuck's sake, why do these all die out at the same time? Really annoys me that that happens. Yeah, of course. Uh, da -da. Put this back in for now. We're going to that Largo today. I just don't... With the way this is changing, all of a sudden, I'm going to have to really think about how I'm doing this. Because um, I'm going to need a site for gathering materials. no choice in that matter at this point so what else can I do I could make tab a uh, Rocco tabs I suppose that could work and that would save me a spot so if we activate that purchase a corral purchase that purchase that that plort collector auto feeder now I don't remember what do you like you're a veggie okay that's good to know. Two, three, four.